Brought to you by XMWX Satellite Weather, Never Fly Blind Again, and by Lightspeed Zulu, More Than Quiet. I'm Mike Schofield with Dynon Avionics. We have a lot of development on Skyview that's, uh, that's really exciting, but one of the worst kept secrets uh, from us is that we're working on a comm radio for Skyview. As a bit of a research project to learn about FCC certification, we uh, started work on a handheld radio a couple of years ago, and we finally have a batch of them that we're ready to sell. So this is the DX15 uh, lithium-ion uh, airband transceiver. It's a uh, small, compact. It has a lithium-ion battery. Uh, it has 100 memory channels that can be scanned in banks. Uh, it does has, have, as I mentioned, a uh, lithium-ion battery pack that's standard. Uh, it's got backlit screen and keypad, 100 memory channels. There are two different ways you can scan them, either all in one bank or you can configure it so that it, it, it breaks them up into uh, banks of 10 memory channels each so that you can have different banks uh, for different airports. And we're going to be selling the first 100 of them uh, via an online auction. It's kind of a Dutch auction where we will have 100 people can go online to dynonavionics.com slash rate slash radio and uh, put in a bid of at least $75. Comparable radios sell for about $250. The top 100 bidders will be able to purchase the DX15 at the lowest price that makes it within that top 100. So the DX15 radio is the, the big announcement at Sun and Fun, but we are still have lots of uh, good stuff coming on Skyview. We just released version 3.0, which uh, adds a lot of features to the moving map. Uh, there's more robust airport information. There's support for worldwide aviation data via Jeppesen subscriptions. Also in 3.0, we have uh, a G meter, which can be set to automatically pop up when you reach uh, certain G thresholds that are user configurable. Um, and just a lot more coming. In the next few months, we'll have uh, more robust flight planning for Skyview, and then really just completing the system. Uh, eventually, as, as we said, we will probably have a comm radio in, in the not-too-distant future, and just keep, you know, we'll keep adding features that our customers are asking for.